Minecraft trailer, take two. This clapperboard has nothing filled out on it. No time, no date, no director, no nothing. The reflection of this guy's hand is nowhere to be seen, even though the reflection of the B can be seen clearly. But something always got in the way. The frame of this sign and the frame of that sign are very different. Like one's more scratched out and stuff. And you can't just say this is a time difference because he's a kid in both of these. And then it immediately cuts back to the first one. The particles on this Warner Bros logo. Oh yes, I'm really getting picky about a Warner Bros logo. They all disappear at the same time very quickly. Unlike Minecraft where they all disappear randomly and stay along for a long time. But the call of the mines was too strong. So one day, I started digging, and digging, until I found... This right here is a real language you can decipher. It's called the Standard Galactic Alphabet. And I started translating it. Iron. And at this point, I got pretty excited. I was like, oh, it might say something real. And then the rest of it said, Gateo Amino Goinot. Yeah, that doesn't really mean anything. I mean, the last line is stone backwards, so that could mean something. But as for the rest, I'm not sure yet. Bad aspect ratio transition is what I was about to say until I saw what came right after it and I realized, oh wait, just regular bad transition. These sheep are still alive with this wolf living here. There are two naturally occurring pink sheep here. That is a chance of 0.00027. And yes, I did do my math correctly. I was in math class earlier today. That's one in 371 1,102. Sorry, I had to look at my notes for that one because it's so big. This has only occurred once in documented Minecraft history, and they weren't by each other. They just found two pink sheep on the same day. Game of the year, 1989. Whatever. I barely think about it. Jason Momoa would have been 10. That's pretty impressive. Um, I don't really know what Garrett's doing on the floor in this scene, but... Oh gosh, do the villagers look terrible at? Also, none of this is actually possible in Minecraft. Especially these horrible gosh darn roofs! This wandering trader doesn't have his llama, so either some terrible accident must have happened, or Steve is just as cruel to them as we are to them. Picklins transform when they get into the... Oh, be quiet. We all know this is Minecraft Legends, the movie. This shot actually does look better in this trailer as opposed to the first one. With better detail and less saturation, so I will remove a mistake. Good job. There are dark forces who want to destroy this world. This is a fake Minecraft font that you can find online on the internet. The people that made the Minecraft movie, or I guess a Minecraft movie, got the fake text off the internet. You can tell by this T right here being like a, the, the line's not low enough. Again, these roofs aren't possible. These arrows are disappearing as they hit the ground, which that doesn't actually happen in Minecraft. So you can't just blame it on like all goofy Minecraft physics. Fake Minecraft text from online. You can tell this time by the half pixel gap in between each of the text. Honestly, I don't even know what half of this stuff is. So it's up to interpretation, but the lectern at least, they could have gotten the books right. First, it's a large red book, then a medium green book, than a small blue book. And that's it. Actually, overall, I really like this trailer. It's a lot better than the first one, and it makes me a bit more excited for the Minecraft movie. But there is a weird amount of mistakes for an official Minecraft movie, especially that text one that just keeps getting me. Anyway, um, make sure to subscribe. Maybe I'll make uh, every mistake in the Minecraft movie. A Minecraft, <laughs> that still gets me to this day. I hope you liked that video. Video, please comment if you did or not. If you comment that you didn't, it will attract lots of bots. Just kidding, my channel is still quite small, so we don't have to worry about bots at all.